but I, like where's the easy really like even in Nigeria, it's not easy yeah. so it's not easy here too i just feel like you have to prepare your mind like you're going to be really lonely here the mm. white people are not friendly generally it's not like they're not friendly but they're not african friendly your yeah. neighbors will not necessarily offer to assist you I swear. with anything true. yeah so you just have to prepare your mind that you're yeah, coming to mind. do it alone yes. and don't have like big expectations Expectation. don't get here and expect that okay i want to be driving a car and yes. all that then hello beautiful people what's up guys what's up everyone i'm here on the streets as you they hot as you they show and i met my sister here and um just the way we do it we want to know the challenges that she faced here as a foreigner so may we know your name and where you came from um my name is abisola i'm from nigeria oh uh how long have you lived here in finland um just about nine months now oh nine months so she's just a newbie here in <laughs> finland oh my god uh what was the expectation when you are coming because when i was coming i thought that this obodo ibo is all it's all luxury and all those but yeah. a lot of challenges you know even raising children here alone and without our mother it's so difficult i know you had a lot of expectations so what are the expectations are and what is the reality we are facing now as a foreigner here uh well like you said you know when you hear that people are abroad you expect that you know it's a life of ease and there's no stress and anything yeah so although coming like i did not expect that oh, okay i would just get here and i would start seeing euros on these streets yeah but it, it's not what it's like like you never know until you're actually here yeah. you have to walk double <laughs> like it's it's really really it's exhausting <laughs> you work all the time those people in nigeria if they ask you for money I, I, will you explain to them that it's not easy here what yeah. will you tell them that's the thing people, people don't understand they, they just expect you you know like people will just message you and be like ah, i have little challenge yeah. i need like 200 i'm like i need 200 000 too. <laughs> if, if you give me yeah. then i will take it so honestly like being abroad i feel yeah. like you have to you have to hustle it's double the hustle well. no, it's not like no niger as in it's not like niger you know in niger yeah. we pay our rent yeah. in a year even if you live in somewhere that is really expensive yeah you even if you pay three million naira for your rent yeah. in a year in nigeria that means you're living in a very high brow area you know yeah. very beautiful house but yeah. here <laughs> <laughs> averagely if you if you live with your family you know yeah. husband wife and a child even uh, one child yeah your house rent is probably around 700 euros I if swear. you are lucky <laughs> I swear. you know and you know that's almost eight hundred thousand naira yeah. in niger money so yeah. and you pay every so in a year you're paying like 10 million if you calculate the money or yeah. nine points so it's not as easy as people think it is i guess yes, that's my point i swear somebody sent me a message in my facebook and he she dropped her account number said nigeria no days i should send her money she never even asked me if i'm <laughs> eating or i've paid my rent or all those as in it's just the expectation is just so high back home okay yeah. how did you feel about the weather uh yeah like that was a shocker for me of course i know <laughs> yeah. that it's cold because yeah my husband has been living in finland for a long time so yeah. i know it's it's really cold here but it was really surprising you know i came in may and everybody was like oh this summer it's not cold but it was very cold yeah. the temperature was like maybe 16 or 15 degrees and yeah it was too much for me but of course now i understand because now i, I cannot even wait for may to come i want to be 17 degrees <laughs> again <laughs> because it gets so cold you yeah. know during winter and yes, all that yeah this is so nice okay what do you like about finland so far well i, I like that it's it's safe it's very yeah, safe nice. you know I, coming from somewhere that insecurity is a major problem and it keeps mm. getting worse mm. so I, I like the fact that i like finland is really safe you know yeah. i go out for walks around 10 or 11 p.m mm. and everything is fine yeah yeah how, how do you manage uh the your baby you have a child right yes. how do you manage raising her alone without your mom you know in nigeria mother will come child visit and all those things how do, you, how do you manage everything well i, I think i'm one of the lucky ones my oh, son really? is six already ah, so okay. <laughs> 
market. Yeah, so of course he does not have the needs of you know like an infant. Yeah. You know, of course he, he, I can't still leave him alone yet, alone. Yeah. So it means anywhere I'm going, it's buy one get one free. That's yeah. always the situation. Yeah. But the the only challenge majorly is like you know they don't listen here. They're very empowered. Yeah. They know to say oh my mom sm- smacked me or something. <laughs> <Yeah>. So. <laughs> For me, that's 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 the only challenge. But yes. honestly, I, I don't feel like I have it as bad because he knows, you know, you can't you can't do bad things and not expect you know like to be cautioned or stuff like that. Yeah. Of course, no spanking, but there are other things like I like you said, I've learned to improvise. There are other things that you can do yeah. to caution a child aside from actually you know physically hitting them because here you know it's like abuse and it's yeah. it's like yeah. a big, such a serious offense. You don't want. Yeah social to call you and say what happened to this child or something yeah. like that so what what advice do you have to uh tell uh, somebody that is still preparing to come to europe for me it's not easy it's not the expectation we have back home everything is not easy you need to struggle so what is your advice to people coming you um well if you if if, if people like for people that still want to come mm. It's a really good country. Mm-hmm. There are like opportunities to survive. Yeah. It's not easy, but at, like, where's the easy really? Like, even in Nigeria, it's not easy. Yeah. So it's not easy here too. Yeah. I just feel like you have to prepare your mind. Like, you're going to be really lonely here. Mm-hmm. The white people are not friendly generally. It's not like they're not friendly, but they're not African friendly. Yeah. Your neighbors will not necessarily offer to assist you I swear. with anything. Country. Yeah. So. Yeah you just have to prepare your mind that you're yeah, coming to mind. do it alone yes. and don't have like big expectations Expectation. don't get here and expect that okay i want to be driving a car and yes. all that then don't don't start by looking for like a big paying job too yes. there's nothing wrong with like waitressing mm. cleaning mm. W- m- money money does money is money like yes. whether you get it from the big offices or oh, no. <laughs> you get it from cleaning yeah. your bills don't know the difference and your stomach yeah. does not know the, hunger yeah. does not know money from cleaning yes. or yes. money from you know just yeah. walk your way do like basic jobs and yeah. and the, like low income is better than no income at yes. all yes that is so good yeah wow. so that's wow, just wow, it wow. It's so nice having you on board. It's so nice having you on this video. How do you feel being on camera for the first time? <laughs> it's weird. Actually, like this is the first time that I'm featuring. Or usually when I when I'm in a video, it means that I'm maybe recording okay. myself. I'm a makeup yes. artist. Okay. So cool. you have a good skill. You can just start YouTube channel and Facebook. They will pay you so much money. You never know. All right, I will <laughs> Yeah. Mumbo. <laughs> Okay, thank you guys. Say hi to my viewers and thank you so much having you. God bless you.